Uh, can you present the game Spark? Sure, Spark is a VR sport, or a V-sport as we like to call it at CCP, that's only possible in virtual reality. It was created specifically for VR and is only playable in VR, and uh, basically your VR equipment becomes your sports equipment. So the, um, you know, the move controllers are like your tennis racket, and you've got your VR headset, um, and it basically it's a VR sport. So the game will be released only on PlayStation VR or other VR uh, things? Uh, the game's being released first on PlayStation VR uh, next week on the 28th of August. Uh, we have shown it before on Oculus Rift and HTC Vive, but uh, we're just focused on PSVR right now. It very, uh, works well. We really think we are in the game. So it's the, uh, the experience with Eve Valkyrie. Uh, you you earn from uh, VR uh, experience. Yeah, we you know we've been working in VR for quite a while. We were one of the first people to get um, the Oculus Rift, uh, uh, the first development kit from them. Um, you know we this is this will now be our fourth VR game. Uh, so you know I think with every game we release, we learn a little bit more, not just with Eve Valkyrie, but also with Gunjack and Gunjack 2 on mobile. So uh, in the future, other VR games, you think uh, CCP will be. V, v studio of VR? Gosh, I hope so. I'm not, I'm not going to make any predictions. Uh, we're certainly doing our best, but we, we hope so. Uh, let's talk about Spark again. I think there will, there will be um, a rank, rank system with, uh, don't know, uh, levels, uh, something like that. Yeah, so uh, competitive play in Spark is definitely something we're super interested in. It's uh, obviously um, very appropriate, uh, but we're gonna we're gonna first focus on listening to our players when we release. So it won't be available when we release. We want to see how they play the game, what they want, what features they want to see from it. Uh, but certainly, uh, that's on our list. Would we would we be updates on the game with new modes, something like that in the future? Yeah, I mean, CCP really prides itself on uh, the running these games as a service. And in fact, EVE Online will celebrate its 15th year next year. Uh, and we've been updating it constantly for all 15 years. So, um, yes, absolutely, we will be working on updates and new features and modes and maps and um, all kinds of things for Spark after launch. Do you think uh, some players from PlayStation would be can be play with... No, no, PC gamers, something like that, or crossplay. Uh, there's nothing stopping us from having crossplay. Um, I, you know, like I said, we're focused on PlayStation uh, VR right now. Um, but just like with Eve Valkyrie, where you can play between uh, PC and PlayStation 4, uh, there's absolutely no reason we can't do the same thing with Spark. Nice. Thank you. Thank you, Adam. You're very welcome. Thank <laughs> you.